And you? I'm doing really well. Thank you for asking. Um, and so, yeah, yeah, what have you been up to? What have you been up to today? Again, say it again. I, I, I can't hear it very well. What have you been up to today? What have you done today? Uh, today, uh, it's my. It's, uh, today, I am uh, on on uh, on, on at, at my home. It's, today is my uh, weekend. Mhm. Mm okay. Uh, so just sorry. Spending time at home. So is there is a problem. Yeah. There is a problem in in browser. Do you, you hear me now? Yeah. Okay. Today, oh, okay. as as I told you, it's my weekend. It's uh, yeah. second day in my weekend. Awesome. Just uh, so. yeah, just uh, I uh, I browse internet, uh, see some films, uh, and uh, call some friends, and uh, that's it. Okay, so browsing the internet, watching some films, seeing friends, cool. Um, all right, yeah. Uh, that sounds like a good weekend, good end to the weekend at least. Um, Thank you. And Julieta, welcome to class. How's it going, Julieta? Hello, she's going well. Thank you. Nice. Okay, good to hear. Uh, and what have you been up to today? I had uh, some relatives for lunch, and then mm, nothing. Relatives for lunch, then nothing. All right. It doesn't sound bad. Um, what do you eat for lunch? Uh, rice with mushroom and uh, mm, risotto and uh, vegetables. Nice. That sounds delicious. Okay. And Anna Carolina, how is it going with you? I'm fine, thank you. Okay. Nice. And what have you been up to today? Uh, this morning I took some classes. Okay. I, I, um, not this morning, uh, two, three p.m. Then I, I went for a ride in my bike. That's all. And now I'm okay. here to study nice. a little bit more. Okay. Good to have you. Um... And what kind of bike do you have? Do you have like a road bike or a mountain bike? Uh, it has 21... Uh, how can I call? Oh my gears. gosh. Uh, yes, 21 gears. And it is made of aluminum. So I don't know. I think it is a mountain bike. Is okay. it? Does it I have shocks? Shocks? On the front, so like, are the handlebars wide and like straight, so like flat, or are the handlebars kind of curved? Curved, curved, and it has, oh my gosh, how can I call something that is similar to, ah oh gosh, to a spring, I don't know the name in English. Shocks, springs, shocks. Yes, yeah, shocks, shocks, yes, 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 it has shocks. And curved handlebars, like like bullhorn curves. Yes, it has one one shock under my bench, and and the um, the handle is curved. Hmm. Uh, the branch is alloy, I guess. Uh, hold on, one second. Okay. Um. Yeah. Well, alloy. Um, it's an alloy. Okay, I'm not sure. Alloy, I'm, I'm, alloy, alloy. Okay. Oh my gosh. I don't. Deal. I don't know th those words. I couldn't even remember. Shall I can. Okay. And gears. Yeah, that's fine. Um, sounds like an. I'm not sure what type of bike it is though. Um, Khalid, Khalid, how's it going? I'm good, and you? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Um, and Khalid, what have you been up to today? Uh, today I'm watching a lot of the game football. Mm -hmm. of, uh, uh, stuff. After okay. uh, for, uh, afternoon until night. 
Okay, so lots of soccer games. Yeah, soccer is a game. Okay. All right, nice. And did your team win? Uh, my my team is won, but it's bad today. Okay, so they, they won, but it was a bad game. All right. Well, good to know. And all right, let's have Monica. How are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Okay, nice. And Monica, um, I guess, yeah. What have you been up to today? What have you been doing? Uh, well, this morning I did the housework, just clean my apartment, okay. and in the afternoon I went to visit my parents, and nice. now I'm here. <laughs> okay. How are your parents doing? Sorry. How are your parents? How was the visit? Oh, <laughs> they they are fine. <laughs> so. Okay. Good. Yeah. Um, and Adela, how are you? Hello. I'm fine, thanks. Okay. Doing well. How was your first week back at school, Adela? Well, a uh, little tired, a week a uh, little tired, but yeah. uh, well, next uh, I think uh, will be more relaxing. Okay. We would probably say it's a little tiring, or it was a little tiring. T tiring or tired? It wasn't a tired week. It was a tiring week. The week is tired. Is tiring, but uh, I'm tired. Yeah, exactly. The week was tiring. I'm tired. Um, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And yeah, hopefully it gets better next week. Hopefully a little bit more relaxing. Um, so we've got a class. We're going to be talking about different hobbies. And let's start with Yehia. Can you read the title and the next lines? Read uh, the lines. Today, we will learn about different habits, practice, conjugating, conjugating verbs, reading comics, and have discussions. OK. Can you repeat hobbies? Hobbits. Read comics and have discussions. OK. Have Yehia, sorry. Can you ask Rebecca the first question? Okay, Rebecca, why do people have hobbies? Because they need to spend uh, their free time doing something which uh, they could uh, uh, enjoy, it, you know, I think. Is to to hold a to fill a hole. A gate. A gate in a good way. In a good way. Yeah, okay, good. Yeah. An enjoyable way. An en an enjoyable way. Yeah, in an enjoyable way. In, uh, yeah. Enjoy. Cool. Good. It's most necessary to have a free time. Maybe you have you be you are busy and have and have hobbits. Can you repeat uh, that? Well, tell me that. Could you play, explain me how you could manage uh, hobbies and be busy at the same time? Maybe I am uh, at work and uh, maybe uh, I do something else that I I love, like uh, playing some games in. Uh, uh, parallel to my work, uh, if uh, if my work allowed to me to do this, uh, it's, uh, maybe maybe I love to do some things, but I don't have I don't have much time to do it. But but uh, but if uh, if I have time, if if I if I don't have time, I still have some hobbies. Yes, that is the concept of hobby. You know, hobby is uh, your, uh, uh, an activity uh, uh, where which uh, you usually uh, <clears throat> do it uh, in your free time. That is the meaning, the concept. When you are working, you know, uh, well, maybe you are lucky and you enjoy your 
uh, you could enjoy your job as uh, when you are doing a, you know, some when you are taking a hobby, but that is not a hobby, you know. Okay. Yeah, I I think I mean, you could hobbies are pretty open for interpretation. I think you're totally right. Free time is doing something to fill your free time. Yeah, and if you're doing something even at work, it's like, yeah, free time in work if it's not working itself. Or you just really enjoy your job. But, all right, good. Rebecca, can you ask Monica the next question? Yes. Can you make money from doing your hobby? Why or why not? I think it is possible to make money from a hobby. Uh, some person, some people can make it, but I personally I can't because uh, my hobbies are uh, uh, riding by bicycle or uh, right now learning English, so it, it's not possible for me to make money out of these activities. Uh huh. Okay, good. But you think it is possible, so you can make money from your hobbies. If you have yes. specific hobbies, good. All right, Monica, can you ask Khalid the next question? Does your hobby influence your choice or friends? No, because my hobby. No, because my hobby is uh, done different. From I don't know what I'm saying. I'm not sure what you mean. No, because my hobby is what? Because my hobby is easy. So it doesn't influence your group of friends, and so like, it doesn't have any effect on who you're friends with. Yeah. I have. Because your hobby is easy. What's your hobby? My hobby was uh, TV. Watching TV? But, uh, game football, like that. Like what? Like that. Uh, I, my hobby was TV, game football, and reading. Okay. So your friends don't share your hobbies? Sometimes. Okay, so your friends sometimes share your hobbies. You think you're friends with certain people only because they share those hobbies? So is there anybody who you only like spending time with because you watch games together? You play sports together, you watch TV together, or you talk about books? Yeah, that's right. Um, all right. All right, what about you, Julieta? What do you think? Do you think your hobby or your choices of hobbies influence your choice of friends? It's generally yeah. not. Can you explain? I have a friend that uh, is my friend only because we watch a football game together. Soccer game. Uh -huh. <laughs> so um, we do session um, watching soccer and uh, um, chattering via WhatsApp. But Okay, so generally not. So you do have one friend who is your friend because of your hobbies, but other than that, probably not. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. I think we're good. Let's go on to the next page. Anna Carolina, can you read through the words? He creates some billiard mountaineering. Knitting, riddles, stamp collecting, 
cycling, card games, gardening. Okay, really well done. Um, let's start with recreation. 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 <coughs> recreation. Good. Nice job with that R sound. You said knitting really well. Generally in the U.S., we'd probably say knitting. Can you repeat knitting? Knitting. Yeah, so the double T kind of becomes that D sound. You can say knitting, too. Um, sounds a little bit more like British English, which doesn't really matter. That's good, too. And then stamp collecting. Uh, stamp collection? Yeah. What did I say? It's stamp collecting. Um, and we want to emphasize the stamp. So stamp collecting. Okay. It's stamp collection. Good. Yeah. Really well done. That's a little bit of a tricky one. Stamp collecting. And any questions here? Does anybody have any questions? Uh, yes. Uh, some of this word, I didn't know the meaning of it. Okay. Which words? Uh, recreation. Recreation means uh, I didn't know uh, I know the meaning or not. Uh, uh, recreation mean uh, uh, construction or uh, new building? Not and no. Recreation. Um, who knows yeah. what recreation means? May I, Joshua? Yeah. Uh, recreation is an activity for enjoyment. Um, when people are not working and usually. Uh, there, there, there is someone in charge of leading people to do fun things. For instance, in a hotel, uh, it must have be a recre a, a person in charge for recreation. I've never been to a hotel like that. <laughs> I guess I don't go to uh, too many hotels. to entertain children. Yeah, so to entertain children, for sure. There's, like, somebody who's in charge of recreation. Yeah, recreation would be kind of playing. So any type of playing would be recreation. So sports, games, other activities. That, like, all fits under recreation. And uh, the next word, Billerin? Billiards. Billiards. Who knows what Billiards. billiards is? May I take a shot? Yeah. I I'm not sure, but I think it's a game similar to to pool table. What yeah. you? Okay. To be honest, yeah, we would actually most of the time in the U.S. we would call pool billiards. They're pretty synonymous. I think the difference between the two games does exist, but generally billiards is pool. Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah really nice job. But. Okay, and the next word uh, also, mountain mountaineering. Who knows that one? Same to hiking, to like to go to the mountain. Yeah. Yeah, so it's like going Clive to mountain, mountain hiking. Clive Mountain? Uh -huh. Yeah, so it's generally a little bit more intense than hiking. So if we've got, like, mountaineering, you're probably yeah. on something that's really high and probably snowy and probably a little bit dangerous. So mountaineering is a little bit more intense maybe than hiking. Um, again, you need to climb, and hiking normally is a track. Yeah, so mountaineering, you're probably doing some climbing. So you're climbing rocks. Um, and hiking, yeah, is a little bit more of a track. Good. Really perfect. Nice job. Adela, I knew you'd answer that one. Uh, and the next one also, knitting. Knitting. Knitting, yeah, knitting. knitting. Who knows what knitting is? To do sweaters, for example, to do... <laughs> yeah, so people can knit sweaters, for sure. Um, With wood or another tissue. To, to uh, have a, cl a close, a close, different clothes, no? 
Yeah, so you use like two sticks, I guess yes. you'd say, to knit, to make clothes, or to make other things. Um, yeah. Yeah. Any so other questions? Those. Yeah, next okay. one goes for reading. Riddles. Uh, Does anybody riddles. know what a riddle is? May I? Yeah. Okay. Uh, have you have you ever seen Batman? You know his rival. He he's always saying riddle written, and it's a kind of a enigma. <laughs> yeah. Can you be a little more clear? I'm trying. Uh, it's not easy. Um, it, it's a kind of a, a question, something difficult that you, uh, you you have to to guess. You say riddle it, and and then ask something really difficult like a puzzle. Yeah, it's like a word puzzle. Okay. Yeah. And good. Yeah, um, exactly. The last, yeah, yeah. Again, the last word, I didn't know the meaning. Gardening. Gardening. Gar gardening, yeah. Does anybody know what gardening is? I know, but you, would you allow me to answer again? Maybe somebody else. Does anybody else know gardening? Yeah, I think the plant, someone plant something. Yeah. Can you plant something? Like fruits or vegetables? Other plants? Things like that. Yeah. Okay, good. And any other questions before we move on? All right. Go to the next one, and let's start with Adela. Can you try the first one? Uh, yes, um, but I don't know you. Uh, okay, I, to be uh, blank science, uh, I was a shoot. I always been a tree to plant. Um, I, I have... Uh, I have been gardening. Since I was a child, I have always been attracted to plants. Nice. Correct. Is correct? Okay. Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, yeah. What about the next one? Yeah. When we go this. When we when we uh, when we go to this and my, my this this and land, my grandmother never stopped nothing. Uh, never stopped nothing. Uh, she even made me a hat. She even knitting. Can you repeat knitting? Knitting, yeah. Knitting. Knitting. And the past tense of to go? Uh, went to. Yeah, we went to Disneyland. Can you repeat Disneyland? Disneyland. Good. Okay. And Monica, what about the next one? I just... I just... Start it. Start it. Yeah. Um, but next month I'm going to try to scale Everest. Yeah. And scale and climb would be synonyms in this case. Okay. Yeah, crocheting Adela is definitely the hobby. Um, so we'd say crocheting. So the T is silent, I suppose. Um, and Rebecca, welcome to class. Rebecca, how's it going? 
<laughs> well, well, I had I had some uh, issues with internet. Okay, yeah. Well, I'm glad you're back. Uh, can you try the next sentence? Which one is? The ever since. The fourth sentence. The fourth. Okay, thank you. Mm. Ever since I was a child, uh, I. They give me that takes. Ever since I was a child, I. I hate. I, I had to. to pick one of the list. Yeah. Okay. okay. Um. Mm, 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 Billiard. Well, I don't know the meaning of riddles. Riddles? What is What are riddles? Okay, yeah, that's the right answer too. Um, a riddle is like a word puzzle. So, like an example, um, what runs but never walks as a head. Ooh, okay. Ever since I was a child, I I used to no. mm -hmm. I hate the riddle. <laughs> yeah, that's a riddle. So that would be a riddle. It's like a word puzzle. Mm -hmm. What <laughs> you don't have to solve yeah, it either. Yeah, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. What is that? Yeah, okay. Riddles. Okay, this is the the word in English. Yeah. Mhm. Mm okay. And how do we conjugate to hate? Well, I say. Uh, I say uh, in present, I hate riddles. Ever since I was a child. Yeah, but now I'm, I'm, I'm hating uh, the riddles uh, now as well, you know? So, mm -hmm. we see, so I hated in them the as well. in the past, I hate them now. So, we yeah. need something that has the past tense. And the present tense. Okay. What verb tense has the past and the present all at once? Well, maybe the present perfect. Yeah, present perfect. So that would be I've uh, hated riddles. Uh huh. I have hated riddles ever since I was a child. Good. Nice okay, job. Thank you. Riddles. Thank you. Khalid, what about the next one? My little sister have to a huge stamp collecting. She even has old ones with famous production on them. Politicians. Can you repeat politicians? Politician. Politic politician. Politicians. <laughs> Julieta, that's unbelievable. Really good job. It's a river. Um yeah. Politicians. Um <laughs> yeah, I can't believe you got that. Uh politician. Politicians. Politician. And we need to conjugate the verb to have. Have to? Not have to, no. To have. Had? Mm -mm. Any ideas? No. Anybody else?
had. Mm-mm. Long had. I mean, yeah, it has. I guess had could work too. Has had. But she even has old ones. So we we know it's the present tense because of that. So my sister has a huge stamp collection. Um, yeah. And so the answer to the riddle is a river because um, we have a river bed, a river run, um, our rivers run. They have a mouth and they have a head. They don't weep. Um, they don't talk. They don't walk. Um, yeah. Hopefully that makes sense. And let's have Khalid. Can you read that whole sentence? Okay. My little sister has a huge stamp, a stamp collection. She even has old ones with famous blushes on them. Mm, politicians. Bal politician. Paul. Politicians. Politicians. Good. Okay. Does anybody have any questions here? Okay. We could talk a little bit about riddles. Khalid, can you ask Julieta the first question? Yeah. Do you know any riddles? I don't think so. Okay. Um, okay, Khalid, can you repeat riddles? Okay. Did you know any riddles? Riddles. Riddles. Good. I don't think so. Does anybody in class know any riddles? Does anybody know any riddles? I know some. Let's hear one. Okay. A uh, serv servant. Uh, was allowed to make a wish, and and well, uh, he, he made his wish, and his father, uh, who was very poor, became a millionaire. His wife, who was childless for a long time, had a baby, and his mother, who who was blind and um, uh, got she, her sign, sight. How did he do that? Which he, wish he, he made? What did he ask for? What did he ask for? Thank you. Really good. Uh, Right, and any ideas? His wife, teacher, you misspelled. Mm, ah. Good. Okay, I don't have any ideas either. What's the answer? Anyone, does anyone want to take a shot? No? It's not that difficult. Come on. Maybe... maybe uh, no. Just try it out. <laughs> try, no. try, try. No, no. Okay. Okay. Maybe Christ or same or Al is uh, a a biblical uh, person. No, no, no. It's not. It has nothing to do with the Bible. To the Bible. You are really good. All right. What you, what's the answer? Okay. Uh, he wished. I want that my mother see. My son, growing up, is surrounded by my f father's fortune. Oh, nice. I want my mother to see my son. Uh, I want my mother to see my son, yeah. To see Good. my son.
Nice. Uh, you, you don't like it, do you? I do like it. I think that's a really good one. Um, okay, really good. Really nice. Thanks. Judith, uh, can you read this next one? There are four days. Let's start with D. The first two are Tuesday and Thursday. What are the other two? What do you think? That's easy. Sorry. Let's hear it. Tomorrow and today. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. No? Yeah. Really? <laughs> yeah. Today and tomorrow. Good. Perfect. Figured I'd get an easy one for <laughs> you guys. <laughs> um, yeah, that was good. Good answer. And Anna Carolina, can you ask Adela the first question? Adela, which hubs are the cheapest? The more expensive? Um, Sorry, most. The cheapest uh, is uh, to go to to walk or to go to run. Mm. I think it's not necessary. Uh, you don't need transport nor neither car because uh, if you go hiking to the mountains, sometimes you need to take a car or train or bus. Uh, you need uh, uh, to commute, no? Uh, but uh, if you run on the street or you walk on the street near your house, it's cheaper. And the most expensive uh, I don't know, <laughs> but I'm sure uh, people, uh, rich people, uh, could be um, or most uh, expensive uh, hobbies, but I don't uh, arrive to think um, <laughs> the, I the level. <laughs> I can't. Uh, I can't imagine. Yeah, I can't uh, imagine. Yes, the level about uh, the expensive. Okay. Can Maybe anybody think of them? Sorry. Maybe a lot of expensive. A lot. They spend a lot of money. Okay. Yeah. The, I mean, they're definitely expensive things. They do spend a lot of money. Yes. Who can think of a really expensive hobby? Any ideas? Really expensive hobby. Uh, to collect. Uh, um, Art uh, picture to the mm -hmm. famous painter. Painter uh, that is uh, is expensive. Yeah, uh, to go good. to the um, to the subastas. Uh, I don't know the to when uh, they offer. No, the uh, you can offer money for the for the. Statues, etc. I'm not sure what you mean. Uh, uh, go. Um, they are people. Uh, um, they um, they offer uh, an amount, and by uh, person offer the most important uh, amount. Uh, I okay. don't know. Sorry, this is uh, Subasta, but <laughs> I don't know him. I'm not but, sure. I have no idea. Um, yes, uh, one moment. In English? Aux it's it's an auction. 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 Auctions. Auction. It's, uh, uh, to, it's uh, buy, uh, you buy uh, something, a uh, painter, uh, something is uh, have a high value, and you offer for different uh, uh, sellers. Uh, yeah, different so maybe you people. compete with other people to buy. To buy, yes. Uh, yeah. People pay a lot of money, no? For mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Good. Um, all right, and. Adela, can you ask Yehia the next question? Okay, do you think a hobby is different from a sport? Uh, 
maybe maybe there is a different the uh, as a sport uh, if you uh, if you play a sport in a professional way it's not a hobby uh, but uh, a lot of a lot of the sports people uh, people do do it as a hobby so maybe there is a hobby uh, it's totally different from a totally may, may, maybe I uh, I make some uh, I make some hobby uh, it's not a sport and may I uh, make a hobby it's a sport so sport uh, maybe is maybe hobby or not and okay so it can I, be a hobby and it doesn't yeah, have to be yeah Yeah, or it might or might not be a sport. Um, okay, nice, good answer. But a lot of uh, sports people do as maybe as hobbies. A lot of sports people do as hobbies. Um, I do some hobbies, or I have some hobbies. That are not sports. I have some hobbies that are not sports. Yeah, and that might be better. Um, okay, good answer though. Nice. And yeah, yeah. Can you ask Rebecca the next question? Okay, Rebecca, do you have any hobbies you like to do with your family? Mm, well, <clears throat> I'm doing my hobbies usually on my own, you know? I usually do my hobbies on my own. On my own. I, okay, I usually do my hobbies on my own. Um, but with my family, maybe no. No, 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 because, yeah, mm. Mm, well, you know, no. Okay. I say no, 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 <laughs> no I'm thinking, but no, no. All right, so no hobbies with your family, all your hobbies are on your own, good, I think that's yeah. good. Um, and let's go here, let's do some of these, let's have... Monica, can you read these comics? Calls me. I'm late for work. I don't think the school assigned enough homework. I think we'd better get that kid to a psychologist. <laughs> Good. What's happening in the first one, Monica? In the first one, uh, the dad is calling you for Calvin because uh, they have to, to to leave the house and go to work. And but what's happening? And uh, there are some snowmen <laughs> passing the street. Passing <laughs> yeah. the street. Snowmen crossing the street. Good. And, yeah, I think that's perfect. So, what about the second one, Khalid? What's happening in the second comic? Accident with the Sony's man. In this one? Sony man. The snowman. Yeah, but snowman. this is the second one. Se so second one? Okay. I don't think the I don't know what's that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so like, what do you see in the comic? What's what's here? I see man. You want uh, troll about with the ghost? I think. Okay, so it's this is made of snow, so it's not. Because snow? Snow yeah. what? 
It's just That's... it's made of snow. There, everything's made of snow. No, okay. So there's no ghosts. Okay. Yeah, but his, his mouth, big mouth, I don't know. He definitely has a big mouth. Mm. Snow has a big mouth, and yeah. the man walk behind the snow. <laughs> What's the giant snow monster doing? You want to ki- eat something, I don't know. What's up. <laughs> yeah, he's eating snowmen. So there are no. a lot of snowmen, and they're running away from the snow monster. There are some dead snowmen um, right here. No, no, dead. Yeah, so maybe, Judetta, can you explain what's happening in this one? Uh, I can't be Sorry, Kadi. Yeah, I just asked Julieta to see if she could explain. I'm sorry if I don't dropped. No worries. Kadvin mm. mm. did a big, big, big monster snowman. So the dad thinks that he has a lot of time, uh, yeah. enough time to do all the things. Yeah, the dad thinks he has too much free time. To do things, yeah. So the school doesn't assign enough homework. The boy clearly has too much time on his hands. Um, yeah, and we could say maybe like a snow monster. Mm-hmm. Piovra. I'm not sure what's a piovra, Giudetta. A, a giant octopus. Oh, like a kraken. Kraken. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it looks something like that for sure. And yeah, Khalid, what's happening in this last one? Last one? Yeah. The car accident. This one. Yeah. So the car hit the snowman. Snowman. And the people watch. Yeah. So. Hmm. The car hit the snowman. I think that's what it's supposed to look like. Maybe, Anna Carolina, can you explain this last one? You can't explain it? Um, Adela, what about you? Um, I think uh, Calvin has represent. Uh, with uh, the snowman as a real situation uh, and uh, that is confused about uh, what is real and unreal uh, is for that uh, uh, they uh, talk about uh, the psychologist <laughs> because uh, uh, they have a, a snow man on the LA to the because uh, um, they have uh, no shock. Yeah, I mean they're definitely shocked. Yeah, um, Calvin's represented a real situation with this snowman. I don't think he's confused about what's real and unreal. No, no, he's not confused. But uh, they use uh, in an ar- unreal situation. Uh, to the diary, I, I don't know, but uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's a little strange uh, to represent uh, with the snowman uh, a normal situation or an accident. A shock. Yeah, a violent situation maybe. It's definitely yes. not. It's not <laughs> uh, <laughs> really. Uh, calm. Have a, the head is uh, uh, no is. Uh, the body in a part, uh, the head maybe um, is uh, separate to the the body. To the yeah, uh, it's a, a a little violent uh, scene. Yeah, it's definitely a little violent. So, I mean, Calvin's making these like really violent scenes with snowmen, and his parents are maybe like a little bit worried that he's like <laughs> making too violent of scenes with snowmen. 
Yeah. Sorry, sorry. I want to ask about uh, the last word. This psychologist. Psychologist. Uh, what's the meaning of it? Um. So who knows what a psychologist is? A doctor for um, people who have problems uh, with their behaviors. Yeah. So it's a a mind doctor. So a doctor who fixes not fixes but tries to fix people's mental problems. Does that make sense? Yeah. 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 yeah okay. The photo means that the kid has uh, some problem in his mind. Yeah, so that's what the parents are worried about. They're worried that their child has some problems. Um, okay, yeah, and good. So I think that's it. I guess the next question, yeah, yeah. So like making violent scenes with snowmen or being distracting with snowmen, do you think there's such thing as a bad hobby? Uh, no, it's a good hobby, but I didn't try it before because we didn't have a snow in Egypt. Okay. Uh, yeah. But I think it's very interesting. Okay. So interesting. I think it's very good hobby. I didn't try it. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah, okay, I think we're good here too. Let's um yeah, let's skip that. Let's try this. Um so we've got a role play. We've got a bored girl and her mom who is thinking about activities. So yeah, yeah, if you are the little girl, how would you start the conversation? Uh, so I'm the girl? Yeah. Uh, uh, I'm very boring, uh I want to I want to go out to see my friends. Go out to see. This is okay, but that's a pretty simple solution. Maybe she can just be like, "Mom, I'm Mom, bored. Yeah. I'm bored." Yeah. Which I thought, yeah, that was a good start. Mom, I'm bored. Um, Rebecca, how would you answer? Well, I know, I see you. So, uh, what about uh, to go shopping? What about going to have a ice cream? I lost you there for a second. What's up? And then, and then, uh, uh, have a. Um, uh, ice cream. Nice. Okay. And Anna Carolina, how would you answer? Cool. Uh, would you take me down right now? Would you buy me a doll? A new one? And would you take me to the to the playground there as well and would you buy me more stuff more stuff <laughs> let's go let's go hurry up hurry up okay good um, and Monica how would you respond well maybe we can go to the park and see if there's some of your friends there Okay. Um, Khalid, how would you respond? Respond. Uh, let's go. Oh. I I I give you all you ask. Give you how you ask. Um. This mom you're, talking, or you're the girl. Uh, yeah, let's go. Okay, just let's go. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, where are you going to go first, maybe? Okay, where are you go go first? 
Mm, yeah, where are we going to go first? Okay. Um, Judetta, how would you respond? Uh, we can go to the park and go upstairs and take the guide. Go upstairs? Mm. Upstairs. Um, upstairs? Up yes, sorry. Upstairs where? Would I know? Oh. Oh. Somewhere, maybe in a room upstairs? Generally, upstairs mm. is like inside. We can go to the roof of a building. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, okay, we are out of time. Sorry about this. I just saw the time. I do have to go. I've got another class starting up right now. If you guys want to join, love to see you. Thanks for coming in, and hopefully I'll see you soon.